We often talk about personality. What do we mean? Boy, has she got personality. No, I wouldn't give him a job. He can do the work all right, but his personality wouldn't fit in here. Oh, I don't know. I don't like her personality. Do you? What do we mean when we talk about personality? What is your personality? It is the way you get along with other people around you and with your changing environment. You want certain things from other people and from environment. The way to go about getting those things reveals your personality. For example, did you ever want to go one place when the gang wanted to go somewhere else? What did you do? How pleasant was your personality? Did you ever want so much to make a good impression on someone? What did you do? How effective was your personality? Did you ever feel alone, out of place, when you wanted very much to be part of the group? What did you do? How successful was your personality? Let's see how personality works. Bill Woodruff here has something on his mind. He wants something. In fact, Bill has his heart set on something. How he goes about getting it and the kind of success he has will reveal his personality. Let's watch. Mom! Oh, Mom! You needn't shout. I'm right here. I might have to have the car. Help me with this table, Bill. There. But, Mom, I have to have the car for tonight. Where are the keys? Take one end of this cloth, Bill. But, Mom, the car! I heard you. If you're going to insist on having an answer right now, I'd better say no. But, Mom, you can't. It's so warm, Bill. Your father and I may want to go for a drive this evening. Bill isn't doing so well, is he? What went wrong? Let's see. Your personality is the way you affect other people. Think about that. The way you affect other people. Can Bill do better? Can he have a better effect on his mother? Let's see how Bill changes his personality. Let me help, Mom. Oh, all right. How would you like to go to the movies tonight, Mom? It's cool there. I could drive you and Dad to the show before I go. You know, Mom, this is a big deal tonight, the summer formal. My first. Other times, a car isn't so important, but for a formal. I'll get some glasses. I think you might use the car tonight, unless your father has other plans. But I'll try to see that he doesn't. Oh, thanks, Mom. You're swell. Yes, part of your personality is the way you affect other people. Did you see how much more pleasing Bill's personality was? Did you see how to improve your personality? Well, let's go to another house in town and see what else we can learn about personality. Marie wants something. She wants a pleasant evening at the formal tonight with Bill Woodruff. But right now, she wants something else. Barney, do you have my scissors? Here they are, sis. Don't get... Well, what's this? Aren't we romantic? Give me those scissors. Okay. Who's the sucker? I'm going with William Woodruff, if you want to know. Woody Woodruff, my hero. And he loved me so much. Ah, uh, love, love, love. Marie, darling, this is bigger than both of us. Let us fly away, my sweet. Yes, another part of personality is the way other people affect you. 
And if other people have a bad effect on you, it may be time to do something about your personality. What can Marie do? How can she improve Barney's effect on herself? She tried thinking about Barney. What was he after? What did he want? He probably wanted Marie to be angry, to feel hurt, because he feels a bit hurt, left out. He can't go to the formal. Perhaps Marie should include him more. Give him some attention. Like my dress? Okay, I guess. Won't be many years before you're going to a formal. Bet you'd like to go tonight. Uh-uh, not me. I'll tell you about it tomorrow. Uh, who says I'm interested? Nobody, but I'll tell you anyway. Oh, well. Well, let me see you when you're all dressed up, will you, sis? Sure, funny guy. See the difference? Marie concentrated on her brother instead of on herself, and the result was a better personality. Do you see the way to improve your personality? To improve the way you affect other people and the way other people affect you? By concentrating on his mother, Bill improved his effect on her. By concentrating on Barney, Marie overcame her anger. Barney was now having a better effect on her. So, to improve your personality, concentrate on the other person. Find out how to satisfy the other person's motives. But let's go on to another important part of your personality. How does a changing environment affect you? Does your personality keep pace with new circumstances, new situations? Here's a new situation, the summer formal. When you haven't been to an affair like this before, you feel pretty strange. You might even feel uncomfortable. No matter how well you get along with the other person, you still have to meet the challenge of a new environment. Well, here we are. Yes. Are we early? There was hardly anyone upstairs taking their coats off. Well... What can you do? Can you improve your personality in a case like this? Will it help to concentrate on another person? Look, Woody. That fellow over there, he's really lost. Yeah. Uh, come on, let's get acquainted. Hello. Hello. This is Marie Follett, and I'm William Woodruff. We thought we might as well get acquainted. Oh, I'm glad you did. Oh, my name's Bill Russell. Oh, I don't know anyone around here. Well, you know someone now. Where's your date? Oh, Betty. Oh, here she is now. Hi. Betty, this is... I'm Marie, and this is Woody. How do you do? Isn't this a lovely ballroom? Yes, it is better when you concentrate on another person, when you think of helping the other person. Can you do it? Just remember, part of your personality is the way you affect other people. Another part is the way other people affect you. And still another is the way changes in your environment affect you. If you concentrate on the other person, you can get along better you can make a start toward improving your personality. This is only part of the story of your personality, but it's the beginning. And now... Hey, look, there's Howard in his day. Oh, we'd better go over and say hello. Will you excuse us, please? Sure. Okay. We'll be seeing you off now in the evening, I hope. Good night. Bye-bye. Friends of yours, Bill? Yes, friends of mine. I've known them for all of two minutes. But you know, they have something. They, they're able to make you feel like old friends so quickly. It's more than just politeness or friendliness. It's... I'd say they both had wonderful personalities. Wouldn't you? 